A Butler County bus driver is under investigation tonight after several students have come home with injuries. Those students say the driver intentionally slammed on the brakes because they wouldn't be quiet. Here is Luke Jones with a story you'll see only on Local 12. Yeah, it looks just like that. Kayla Philpott's nine-year-old daughter Paisley wasn't on crutches when she went to school Tuesday, but now... They told us that she has soft tissue damage to her knee. And her toes have possible nerve damage. Their injuries, Philpott says, her daughter sustained on this Edgewood school bus. Something happened on that bus. And multiple parents say they've pieced together what that something was. Students claim shortly after leaving Edgewood Intermediate School Tuesday afternoon, the substitute bus driver pulled over and warned them not to be too loud. And she said, um... I will break check, check you if you guys stop being loud again. Students say right as they got to the bottom of this hill, their bus driver slammed on the brakes, then did the same thing a short time later. The force was so great, it sent 10-year-old Kamandi flying out of his seat. Do you know like the window and there's like a metal part that's holding it? I hit my head on that. He went straight to the front from seat 16 or 14 all the way to the front of the bus. Paisley went crashing to the ground, where she says her knee and foot hit a metal bar under the seat in front of her. Everybody starts to scream out, and he just made us hurt ourselves, and everybody starts to cry. Both the school district and the Butler County Sheriff's Office confirm they're investigating, but neither is saying if the bus driver is still driving for Edgewood Schools. I want to see her in court. I want her to lose her job. And she wants all other bus drivers to keep their cool. In Trenton, Luke Jones, Local 12 News. Parents say they have been told there are surveillance cameras inside the school bus. However, they say they haven't been allowed to see that footage.